And hey folks, how you doing? Dern D here, and we are back to Stellaris with uh, Star Trek New Horizons. Of course, the big news, the Victory is Life update, update came out uh, for the New Horizons mod. So we're going to take a look at that, and this mod is uh, very Dominion uh, based, so we're going to be playing the uh, Dominion for this one. So let's uh, pop into a new game here, and uh, hopefully it won't take too long. Old uh, CPU is grinding away here. Okay, so, uh, oh, they have a nice little glossary here now, depending on which quadrant people are in. Uh, we want the Dominion, because uh, there's all sorts of great new stuff going on with these folks. And uh, we are going to select them. Of course, uh, we have Composite Consciousness, Fear, Shame, Loss, Loneliness, Rivalries, Treason, and uh, all of them are impossible without deceit. There's no room for politics without politics. For a different kind of disclosure and government emerges, two wise people can emerge, ocean becomes the drop. Uh, united, the dominion can never be broken, but when alone, every single changeling carries within itself a millennia of knowledge and all the trapping, connection, arrogance, confidence, and abilities of a god. Roller level cap goes up plus two, monthly unity is minus ten. The drop becomes the ocean. The perfect unity of the Great Link is at the very heart of the Dominion. So we get an extra three core sector systems. Consumer goods costs go down. Uh, they're authoritarian. Uh, they have a caste system. Uh, that means influence apparently doesn't change. And we can't be democratic. Uh, slave resource production goes up. They're xenophobes. They don't like aliens. Uh, so they can purge and displace them. They can enslave them. Uh, they have increased uh, opinion from other species. Uh, if we conquer anybody, they won't be getting full citizenship. They will not be allowed full military services. And uh, we can't use refugees welcome. We also have merged awareness, uh, governing ethics attraction plus 25%. Uh, they're considered, I guess, easy overall because they're pretty much a, a powerful force in the universe. So they have the Polaron beam, they have warp travel, of course they have the Founder's Planet. AKA the Great Link. So we're going to select these. And map options, Milky Way Galaxy. Yeah, sure, that's fine for us. Uh, we're going to keep everything here the same. I'm actually going to bump the difficulty back to uh, normal because uh, New Horizons can be difficult at times. I I've learned this. So we have the Victory's Life patch. And while things are loading up, let me go through a couple of the uh, patch notes for it. The new Dominion Member State Mechanic will replace vassals for the Dominion by players to further exploit their subjects. Demanding tribute ships and even planets. The Great Link Mechanic allowing players the ability to dispatch changeling infiltrators to neighboring empires. The 100 Event Chain Dominion appropriate replacement of the Vanilla Pirate Event. That's exciting. You got, you got, if you've watched me play New Horizons before or just Stellaris, you know I love, I really sarcasm here. Love those early pirate events. Uh, dynamic anomaly based on the DS9 episode The Ship. Visual updates for most Dominion ships including a new Dreadnought supercarrier as well as several new station models. Uh, we now start with Polaron torpedoes as the starting weapon. Uh, we have Dominion centric tradition and tech branches. Dominion style custom UI for the sub mod. Now I don't know if, that, uh, if that's working for us. Vorta and Jim Hadara can now be genetically engineered and improved. That's pretty cool. There's also a bunch of uh, new fe features and new ships and stuff. But um, I won't bore you with reading all that because uh, we're going to we're gonna start our game here. So let's begin. And of course, we're in the founder system here. Let's uh, take a look at the old quadrant here. So we do have uh, a few systems already under our control. We have the founder's planet. We have Dothheart Brax, Kirill, and... Music with a K. Uh, we don't have any resources in any of those systems being exploited right now, so let's get on that uh, ASAP. So I'm gonna grab my construction ship. We're gonna start down here. We're gonna build mining stations, and that, of course, used up all of our resources that we had uh, in store at the start of the game. All right, let's pick our science. We have Vorta scientists. Uh, we have the Yondodyne Pulse Warp Engine. Uh, I appear, appear to be playing as Dominion. Did you know that, uh... Uh, okay, so apparently... Allow I, me to introduce Go myself. away, Q. I am... Go away, Q. Did we really have to start uh, off like no, that? No, we, we, we don't need your mineral creep, Q. Thank you. Uh, 
Thanks. As I was trying to say before I was so uh, rudely interrupted by a uh, egocentric, godlike uh, species there. Um, yeah. Okay, so we're looking at all the different technologies here. Uh, let's go for the warp engine upgrade. Uh, influence. How are we doing for influence? We're doing plus two right now. Let's grab that. And we have polarized hull plating, uh, next stage construction, or better sign ships, or a heavy duty construction ship. Let's go for the hull plating just so we can get our military up and running ASAP. We do have unemployment on a bunch of um, planets. Uh, okay, we apparently have some Vorta on the Pounders planet. I don't think they did that in previous editions. Uh, let's see, we have some sodium tetrahydrate. I think we used that for making Ketra cell. Uh, it's been a while since I played New Horizons, and uh, I did do a Dominion playthrough in the in the past, but uh, you know the mechanics were different at that point. So uh, there's going to be a little bit of a learning curve here. So I'm just going to get you to go down here and do some society research for us, since you're not doing anything else. Okay, and uh, I actually have a bunch of unemployment, so let's just move everybody around. So everybody's got a job here now. Of course, uh, we are slow breeders. Um, so it's going to take a while to fill people out here unless I uh, create Jem'Hadar, I think. I think they use like the, the robot mechanic, or at least they used to uh, from Vanilla Slayer. So, uh, Dothheart is good. Alright, we have Jem'Hadar here. They're we got some dilithium crystals, and uh, we got some food coming in. It's uh, reducing the amount of Ketra cell we have. We actually have minus uh, two Ketra cell. Okay, so probably going to have to do something about that. Uh, Brax, two. They're fine. You guys are fine for now. Okay. Uh, so we'll just uh, let our construction ship do its uh, work around here. And uh, Galactic Core. Okay, so they've... Uh, they've changed up the map a little bit. Of course, the the major action in the Star Trek universe takes place down here, the Alpha and uh, Beta Quadrants. But uh, we are all the way up here in the uh, Gamma Quadrant. Yeah, because I think Delta is here and we are Gamma. If I remember my Deep Space Nine stuff. Last time I, I was, like, majorly playing through uh, New Horizons, I was watching Deep Space Nine at the same time. So I had a little bit more awareness of... The universe and stuff, but uh, it's it's been quite a few months since I've seen any of that. So, um, like I, I did watch the latest Star Trek series that uh, that came out, the um, whatever it's called, uh, the one with uh, Michael Burnham. So uh, I, I I really don't know don't know how I, I feel about the new Star Trek. I I really didn't like the start of it. But uh, as episodes went on, it, it did win me over a little bit. There were some very classically Star Trek moments, but uh, I, I'm not completely sold or unsold on it yet. And of course, in classic Star Trek fashion, it usually takes uh, a couple months for kind of Star Trek to get off the ground. So gotta gotta keep that in mind. I don't have my science ship doing anything, so I really should have gotten them doing this stuff uh, at the start of the game, but I did not. Also, First Fleet, got to get myself an Admiral while I'm thinking about it. Um, your cheap ship hull points go up, but you can't retreat. I don't think we need to retreat right now, so I'm going to get Timo Clan here uh, in charge. And how much does it cost for us to build uh, our standard patrol? Technology secured. Okay, that's, uh, that's quite the voice for technology secured. New research. So, that's our society. We could do a penal colony. Uh, unrest goes down. Science station a trading center. This produces different things. So, let's let's grab that. Universal currency. Uh, Alright. Am I seeing any growth on any planets? Or do I actually have to like, physically build populations for that to happen? Build pop. Okay, so I have to build Vorta or Jem'Hadar if uh, I want good things to happen. We don't have much catcher cell right, uh, white right now, so most of the population that I'm going to be building is going to be Vorta, uh, so I'm going to build this, I'm going to build you here. So this is going to take me some getting used to, I, I can't rely on um, plus 46 food, so food's not a, a big issue right now. 
I can't rely on... Uh, okay, so how come I can't build a pop there? Hold on. There, there's probably something really obvious. So I can build it there. Build pop, okay. Uh, I'll build pop. Why didn't I see that before? Alright, so we'll get you there. And uh, curl prime. Uh, two energy, one mineral. I like the idea of that tile. Build pop. Yeah, it, it's going to take me a little while to, to get kind of on to this mechanic of uh, having to physically build people. So uh, just, uh, just keep that in mind. You might want to cut me, cut me a little bit of slack. Hopefully, hopefully you'll cut me a little bit of slack. Maybe you won't. That's fine, too. That's fine, too. You say, dirty, you idiot. Nah, don't do that. Be nice. Build population. Be the change you want to see in the universe. It's already enough negativity out there. Some positivity. I don't think positivity is that. Positivity is actually a thing. Uh, we're going to want this tile, that's for sure, with its uh, three minerals. So we will work towards uh, that. Um, can we actually build colony ships right now? Looks like we can. We just need the technology secured. All right, so we got a uh, better warp engine there. Uh, an optical computer that helps us with tracking and chances to hit. I know in previous iterations of New Horizons, uh, your ships start out like with fairly poor to hit uh, chances. So uh, maybe change that up again. So okay, so there's a whole bunch of um, options here, huh? Not so much for that. Do the better warp engine. And let's save that design. I don't think there's anything I can do for straight up weapons right now. I will uh, upgrade my fleet. Sake Vessels upgraded. Okay. Uh, so we're over 100 minerals right now. So definitely going to want to pop down a population here. Build pop. Delta. There we go. All right, so uh, I mean that's that's pretty interesting that we we do that with the uh, the building. I don't know how long it takes to actually build a Vorta. Does one build a better Vorta? There is a habitable planet down in this system, so that's an option for us to settle uh, very soon. Uh, science ship, how far are you along in uh, doing your survey systems? Yeah. Just kind of starting off there, okay. Also, very soon I'm going to want to pump out some more patrol vessels so I can potentially take care of any pirate issues that come up. Or uh, Apparently there is a uh, Dominion-specific pirate event, so Construction it'll be interesting to see complete. what that, uh, that actually is. Uh, okay. Dominion in the ocean becomes the drop, drop becomes the ocean, Great Link binds all changelings, and it is the link that decisions key to the security are made. As the swell and sway of the link turns once again to matters of state, a number of options are available. We could replace a solid leader. We don't know any solids. We could engage in contemplation, which apparently doesn't do anything, or we could do nothing, which doesn't do anything. By engaging in deep contemplation, we may gain insight that eludes the day-to-day -day clarity of the link. Okay. So that reduces our Technology unity. secured. Interesting. Interesting. So it doesn't look like... We'll have a chance to do much with the unit. Be short range Jem'Hadar fighters. Or little dockyards I'm going to take next. Looks like this is going to be done very soon. Alright, so we're still building those populations. Technology That's secured. Uh, trading center, consulate, and promenade. We've now been unlocked. Frontier clinic helps with uh, habitability, growth speed. Yeah, that might be good. Let's take that. Seem to be pretty pretty powerful in terms of outright science at the start of the game. Apologize if you hear my washer going in the background. I came home from work and just basically tossed whatever needed to be washed in there and then started up New Horizons because I wanted to play it. Uh, we're doing great for energy right now, so I'm gonna put a mining network there. Uh, on this planet, building down here, so this is more of a power focused tile. Uh, the Great Link. The act of contemplation in itself has value. In this instance, no practical applications. So I basically just lost a whole bunch of unity for no reason. Fun times. 
Uh, I'm gonna build me myself a mine there. Rogue Gem Hadar. Okay, so this is uh, the equivalent pirate thing, and they actually have a pretty powerful navy by the looks of it. Uh, navy size 400. Um, we only have a navy strength of 200 right now. Uh, Coming to the Founder's Planet, uh, hoping they'll complete. actually try to attack the station because I really don't have much of a way to defend myself here. Uh, they're probably they're probably going to head down here actually and mess up whatever I built in this system. I'm going to get my construction ship to retreat here. Thankfully, I haven't built that much in space yet. Uh, so patrol frigate takes 301, so that's it's going to be a while before we can actually pump out ships. Enemy presence exposed. Exposed, okay. You guy sounds like a, some sort of Empire dude or First Order person from uh, Star Wars. He's got that... Uh, Construction complete. Core system accent, which is kind of that british -y accent you hear in Star Wars. But that's that's a completely different uh, different franchise, so I won't uh, touch too much on that. Did see the new Star Wars movie, and of course it only came out like five or six days ago. Uh, so technology I won't secured. Talk about the plot or anything, because I know some people haven't seen it yet. Uh, main tactical station EPS manifolds do what? Weapons damage goes up. Let's take that. And what did we just finish? It's a better computer. Uh, so let's take a look at our no, not planets and sectors. Uh, bo do, do, do ships. Okay. Uh, what's this right? Chance to hit and track and go up. That sounds good to me. And we're gonna want to upgrade you folks. Cost 15 minerals. Vessels upgraded. Yeah. So I'm gonna lose what I built in this system. Like I said, thankfully. Tactical retreat. I didn't build too much in space, because otherwise they're just going to mess Construction it up. Construction complete. Okay. So for the next little while, we're going to have to deal Star system charted. with uh, with these pirates. That star system has been charted. So there is a potentially happy world down here. Station so under gonna attack. Want to visit? That's for sure. Um, so we have three ships. Technology secured. Uh, two Construction three. complete. Frontier Clinic is done. Deep Space Science Center. Orbital Hydroponics Diplomacy or Slavery. I don't think we can use Diplomacy, so... We're gonna take that one anyway. Uh, let's just take it to our surfaces. So this mine is up and running. Construction um, complete. This planet's pretty much filled out. All I can Construction do. complete. I guess we built another ship, 290. So it's, it's going to take us a while to get up to the point where we can actually face the pirates. Uh, Coral Prime. Uh, I'm just going to I'm just going to save up and, and get my fleet strength up there. Okay, so they they decided to bug out after that. That's cool. That's interesting. Uh, maybe we'll get like a, a weapon unlocked too. That's going to help out our fleet strength uh, over the next little while as we try to build up here. Fifty-five minerals again, not uh, not spectacular. Um, are there any like super mineral producing? Tunnels? Enemy presence exposed. Are they coming up to the Founders Planet. They are. Like again, I'm kind of hoping they'll try to attack the space station. Tactical so retreat. They'll just lose whatever uh, whatever ships they have, but it doesn't look like they're going to do that. Rogue Gem Hadar, uh, I think we're yeah we're a single mineral off from being able to build another patrol frigate. Enemy presence so exposed. Go. Exposed. It very much reminds me of the Empire accent uh, from Star Wars, and General Th Thrawn or whatever. Um, so yeah, they're just bugging back to their uh, their main territory now. So yeah, we're not going to be building found. anything in uh, space until uh, we kind of get these pirate guys taken care of. Always uh, always becomes a thing for me at the, <laughs> the start of these New Horizons Let's Plays, but uh, that's okay. I mean, I could get a few more minerals by developing that, but it'd be at the cost of uh, energy. Um, 
What's my sign Technology check secured. Uh, Xeno Relations Technology. Okay, so Changelink Founder. My name is Devinus, and I've been leading a team researching advanced studies into non founder behavioral trends. Please announce we've made a substantial breakthrough, offering a number of potential applications. Uh, all right, so we have them. What's the difference? The only thing we can do is Ministry of Intelligence. Uh, deals with slavery. Technology that's, that's secured. Because we know for sure that we can't do anything with um, diplomacy. Uh, farming subsidies, capacity overload. I will take that. That can become good. Uh, Star base level 2. So I think polarized hull plating has been unlocked. Is that correct? Yes. So we'll get that enabled. We have fleet strength of 300 Vessels now. upgraded. 360. So I, ideally I want a couple of more ships. Because uh, they're at 485. So yeah, I would need like two more ships to thoroughly trounce them, so to speak. I mean, I could. Probably wouldn't work. Though. I could try building a spaceport here. Swirling shadows. So shadow play is down there. So actually quite a bit of society research. Uh available down in that system, but uh, we'll be able to unlock that yet. So we're just, uh, we're just uh, continuing secured. saving up here. Upgrade our fleets, upgrade our ships. Uh, so EPS manifold, maybe I can get that on one of my ships. Building speed, transport hub. I'm going to take that. I usually take that a lot later in the game, but I might try doing some different things in this playthrough. Ship designer. Alright, so what do we got here? We have armor plating. And we have a computer. Okay, so there's nothing we can actually upgrade on our, our fleet here. So we'll leave that alone for now. We will be able to start building another patrol frigate at the start of the month. Uh, 307 to build one of these now. Maybe. Does that math work? 309. Barely. Okay. 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 So uh, how's everything else going science-wise? From We're doing great socially because we do have that... Um, yeah, we do have quite a, a few num quite a few social um, tiles on our our home planet. So continue continue exploiting those. Uh, so we're at five ships right now. We're still under strength to their five. They have shields. No, Construction complete. Sometimes the pirates end up with shields where you don't. So we have 435 to their 485 right now. Still uh, still not enough to comfortably uh, take them on. Plus, we're at our naval capacity right now as well. Um, Starbase level 2 might help us with that. I could also try building another Starbase. What I'm going to do is, is build an, another ship, though, and uh, eat the cost associated with uh, maintaining that. It's the only way for this to actually work for us. Technology secured. Uh, technology secured. All right. Uh, leader lifespan goes up. Uh, penal colony. Uh, yeah, let's go with the leader lifespan. I think the uh, changelings are fairly long-lived anyway, but it should affect like the life uh, of, say, our, our Jem'Hadar and our uh, forces. Star so. system charted. Another system's been charted. Oh, wait. Minerals down there. Okay. Um, is this within our border? It is. That's uh, that's very tempting. Uh, four or three. So one more month. We'll start building another ship. So what I might try? I might try. Well, they're going somewhere. Uh, all right. So we're going to contemplate again. Uh, we're going to lose the unity. I mean, I, I could decide like not to do anything with that. But I want to see if anything neat comes up. They're going. Up, they're going over there, huh? Interesting. Uh, patrol frigate, so we'll build another one of those. Again, that's going to put us over our naval capacity. But what I was thinking is uh, we start building another starbase here, and we have our fleet in to kind of protect that starbase. It's a plan. I don't know if it's a good plan, but it is a plan of sorts. Uh, we'll see, we'll see might be short first episode as I completely ruined my game. Uh, how much is it to build Starbase? It's usually a bit 300. Oh, we got a whole bunch of Unity. Okay. 
All right. So, Construction complete. Uh, we didn't get a chance to adopt anything. Still 21 months. Uh, so that's kind of like a gambling thing. You can gamble Unity to try to get a whole bunch. Uh, I don't want the edict list. I want the Starbase 300. So if I start building that... Question is, where'd their fleet go? Is it over there? 508, so we should Technology secured. do them fleet buys now. Transport hub is done. Better computers, better... Influence, let's do that. Leader lifespan, tech is coming up, that's... Enemy presence exposed. Oh, they went back down there, okay. Went quite a ways around there, so I'm probably going to lose that space station. But at least we can intercept them now. Or at least try to. Station but like under said, attack. We're probably going to lose uh, this this power station. Now, I'm actually surprised that they didn't blow it up in their their first run. And I should have known secured. that they're going to come down here to uh, attack that border range expansion. I'm going to grab that. Starbase level two is almost done. Uh, two ninety seven. So I want one more. My fleet Zero didn't G make it down in time. Violently diminished. Technology secured. Okay. Starbase level two. Uh, destroyers, let's unlock that. That's definitely going to give us an advantage on the pirates, so we're going to jump in a little bit too late. Here. Uh, a thought has spread throughout the Great Link. To understand the solace, we must live as them again by sending hundreds of our spawn into the galaxy. They may return in due course with invaluable information. Let's do it! Situation the hundred. updated. Do I have to do anything for it? The hundred. Uh, it's going to take us 480 days. Let's do it. Let's do it. Follow the uh, Deep Space Nine timeline. That's how we got Odo. He was one of the uh, hundred that was sent out into the universe. Also, the other changeling that showed up in that episode, I guess. It had one of those punchable faces, I always thought. Enemy presence exposed. Exposed. We've been exposed. So much exposure. Uh, so Tactical retreat. Trying to catch up with these folks. I don't know if we'll do it. If we can catch them before they get to their station, that would be great. But it doesn't look like that's going to happen for us. So yeah, like I said, maybe enemy presence exposed. Maybe start building a star base here and then have the fleet protected. But I would like uh, a little bit better fleet strength before we do that. Their base has an 800 strength. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, 308. So uh, yeah, I actually want to do another patrol for good after that. And what else we got for science? Destroyers in 11 months. Oh, geez, I didn't want you guys to follow them. Uh, so I'm going to get you to come home afterwards. For now. Get back there. We might end up in combat if these guys decide to come down. Nope. Okay. That would have been great, actually, to draw them away from their base. I really wish I had caught them down here, though. That would have been, uh, been good for us. Uh, border ranges goes up. Space Science, Re-Education Campaign, let's take that. Recurdy. Interesting name for a system. Uh, sounds like some sort of car dealership. Come buy your latest vehicle from McCurdy Auto. Nope, there's probably a McCurdy Auto somewhere, but that's just it's one of those names that I would associate with a uh, with a car dealership for, for reasons. Uh, so the Starbase has been upgraded here. Uh, so we have another patrol... Frigate being built. Um, again, destroyer in eight months. Maybe we just want to wait until we can build one of those. Just like save our minerals Star until that happens. Charted. It's a thought, and again, it might not be a good thought, but it, it is a thought of sorts. I don't know. I don't know. Construction complete. So we're at 65. Why are you... You need to be the rally point, please. Are you the rally point now? Or did I turn you off the rally point? Okay, you are the rally point. Alright, I need you guys in one pile of death, though. 
Queen's Panda. Thank you. Uh, so how much longer? So we get the shortest? Five months. And that should let us have whatever minerals we need to actually build one of those. So maybe I'll do it that way. We are really over our naval capacity. Um, yep, yeah, this, this is kind of standard early New Horizons, uh, dealing with dealing with the pirates. <laughs> and there's probably there's probably people who play this who, who don't struggle with this as much as I do. I, I'm sure. I'm sure they exist. Um, but anyway, that's that's fine. I'll do things my own way. Might not be the best way. There's the right way, there's the wrong way, and then there's the darn D plays way, which is like the the long way only, uh, the wrong way only longer. I stole that from The Simpsons, so I freely admit that. Um, two months, okay. So I am willing to wait. Like I said, I, I am saving the minerals so I can actually build a destroyer and uh, deploy it. Once uh, that happens, scientist is leveled up. Uh, one month now, okay. This guy is not a great scientist. He likes rockets, though. Good for you. Who doesn't like rockets? Technology secured. Uh, a couple science scientists have leveled up. Destroyers are ready to go. Uh, Hangar Bay, short range gym, and our fighters. Hmm. Let's go with that. Does the Jam Hadar fighter are kind of like a staple of the Dominion? Uh, I guess we need to have the level 3 star base to actually build a uh, destroyer. Oh, let's, uh, or do we not have a design? We have to design it from scratch. It's okay with me. No section secondary hall. All right, so we want, uh, we want all the weapons. Please and thank you. And what we got here? So we have armor plating. We'll drop that down. We have a blue thing. Uh, a targeting computer and just a generic one. Nothing, nothing to do there. Uh, picket superior tracking goes up. Sensor range skirmisher. So these guys will be at medium weapons range. Okay, I'm okay with that. Um, grappler. Better thing. That's the better thing. Okay, and let's call this a destroy because I am not feeling very creative with names right now. Okay, I guess I I made it. Destroy class destroyer. Very very creative. That's uh, some fine thinking there, Durandy. So I, I think we just barely had enough minerals to build one of those. That's cool though. That's cool. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be built. Uh, what, what's the Special title? project what complete. A uh, hundred have been separated from Link and sent out to the galaxy. A hundred capsules have been dispersed in every direction. The Link yearns now for the day when it will be made whole again, through though it re recognizes the value of the project. Okay. Uh, apparently some, some person died because we did that. Let's, uh, so, person working at the power station, I guess. Interesting way for the game to do with that. Uh, yeah, I was trying to. I want to take a look at my ships. Uh, to, to combat speed, shields, evasion, special damage. Power is 159. Okay. Uh, we actually have a tradition now. So, frontier, domination, prosperity. Ship cost goes down. I like the idea of that. I really anomaly like the idea of that. We have an anomaly. Let's check that out. And, uh, yeah. We'll keep on building that. Uh, well, we can't replace Assault Leader. We don't have any unity, so we're just gonna do nothing. This, this is basically the, the changeling version of watching Netflix in your underwear, I guess. Um, okay. Well, we'll let uh, things speed along and we'll see what our combat strength is once we get our destroyer here. Uh, maintenance power, cost, combat speed, damage 159? Is that what it is? No signs. Okay, so that was a failure. Um, and it, how much does it cost to build one of these? 605. Maybe if we had two of those to take on their space station and their fleet. 
It's the thing. I don't want to lose ships either. But I, I could, again, I could possibly draw off their fleet by starting to build a space station here. That should draw them off. Because I don't want to engage both their fleet and their uh, starbase at the same time. Because uh, starbase can pack Normally a punch found. and it's got a lot Construction of help. Complete. Really, uh, really would like a, a weapons upgrade. That would be great. Uh, of course, we're losing all sorts of stuff because we're way over our, our naval capacity right now. Uh, 760, and it is uh, 800 for that. For their starbase, eight, so about 900, 150. So that would put us at about 900 for strength with two destroyers. So I'm going to save for that. So that's going to take us a couple more months. Uh, nothing really good technology wise to help us with the military coming up. But maybe something good will be unlocked in the meantime. So we'll have to wait a couple months. Should be a tech unlocking here. Yeah. Uh, tactical station. There we go. Focus Polaroid Beam 2. So that uh, that would be a big help to us. That's 29 months away. Uh, good thing about the pirates. I mean, they're, they're kind of stuck with whatever they uh, they build uh, in terms of technology. I don't think their, their tech goes up. Uh, so next month, I should be able to build this or start the build. So we'll wait for that to happen. And uh, I guess that's the strength of uh, playing the Star Dominion. System you can charted. actually afford to go over your damn capacity by quite a bit uh, at the start of the game here. I uh, really want to exploit this system, but these folks need to be taken care of first. Okay, uh, Great Link, start the destroyer. So, here, yeah, here's what I'm thinking. We'll get this destroyer built. We're going to move up here. Then we're going to start construction of a space station. That should hopefully draw these folks down. My fleet should be able to overpower them at that point. Send the guys back after they're destroyed and start attacking their starbase. So that sound like a plan? It sounds like a plan. We'll see. We'll see if it's a good plan. Time will tell. Time will tell. But it will take a little bit, a uh, little bit of time to get stuff built up here. Uh, Alright, uh, any other things I want to exploit on system Technology energy? Secured. Not really a big thing. Hangar bays. This will really help. Next stage construction. Advanced destroyer prototype. Take that next. Um, minerals. There's a two mineral slot right there. So, um, Actually, I should wait because it's going to cost us 300 minerals to start building the uh, another space station up here. So we'll wait till we can do that. The destroyer should be done at that point, or fairly close to it. So it's a, it's a little bit of waiting. There is a, a couple of potential habitable planets now. Well, 28, that's a fairly sizable one. Like I said, this system, really, really interesting. Too bad I wasted uh, building this at the start of the game. I should have known better. But it, to be fair, it's been a while since I played New Horizons. I forgot how annoying the pirates could be. I, I was vaguely aware of how annoying the pirates could be, but <laughs> it didn't really hit me until they, they blew up my stuff. So we're at 300. That's almost done. Alright. Uh, yeah, we'll wait till this is built. Because I, I want to be able to defend that Construction wall. Construction I don't want to lose it, like, right off the hop here. Alright, so... First fleet, you're going to go to this system. You're going to go to the first fleet. Go in orbit. There we go. So we'll wait till they're in orbit. And then we'll do what we try to do. I mean, I could build one more destroyer here. Nah. I'm going to try my, my plan of daring do here. Plus, we need more star bases so we can actually support uh, the ships that we have. Some nice minerals over in that. Technology system. secured. Uh, Re-education, that's cool. How long till the polar on beam? 34 months, so yeah. It's... Hopefully the pirates will be gone by the time we get to uh, that stage in the game here. 
Alright, so here we are. So we gotta wait for them to do the warp cooldown. So we'll see if hopefully they don't get drawn off by uh, the base here. And I'm kind of hoping us building that will prompt these guys to attack. Oh, here they come. Okay. So we're, we're just gonna attacking just enemy vessels. Sit back here. Let's zoom in. Slow things down so we can see the pretty phasers. I'm kind of hoping we don't lose any ships because they are so expensive. And I kind of wish we would focus fire a little bit more instead of distributing the damage. You guys need to play the original Final Fantasy. You take one enemy at a time. You don't distribute any damage. Any basic RPG player knows that. Focus. Focus. Okay, this one's almost dead. If someone would just shoot it. Uh, 54%. Yeah, that, uh, that kind of sucks. There at 68. Anomaly found. Uh, we have an anomaly. Then three ships. Two ships. So this should be uh, an easy victory for us. And it looks like we're going to get through this without losing any ships. That's, uh, that's a big one for us. Okay. Just keep shooting them. Keep shooting them. Come on. I was going to say that. Uh, so close to dying. And apparently, only my destroyer wants to shoot. You trying to retreat, or is he trying to do the circle of death? Played the played Mech Warrior. Okay. All right. So here we go. Here we go. Plan. All right. So we're going to go in orbit here, so we can protect this. Uh, I will actually try to build one more destroyer. Uh, that should get our naval strength up. How much longer before? 30 months. That would be the big thing for us, the better Polaron beam. Uh, so yeah, we'll save up for that. So I'm going to have to speed things up again. Um, oh, it's the silent enemy. Uh, yeah, let's attempt to follow the ship. We'll see what happens. Let's hail them. And uh, we got into a whole bunch of society research. That's cool. That helps us with orbital hydroponics. Not a big deal since we're producing 47 food a month. Uh, well, we can, yeah, let's contemplate. Why not? Excellent. We're maxed out for energy right now. That's that's great. If we could do the same thing for minerals, I'd be uh, I'd be super happy about that. Uh, 605. So yeah, we got we got a few months before we can do anything with that. Of course, the big thing is our naval capacity is sucking right now. I mean, I could help out a lot with that. But yeah, the fact that these guys are in orbit of a system that doesn't have a, a space port. Star system no charted. Uh, star system charted. So there is a ooh nine minerals over here. Um, Looks like a pretty good system. Not really, though. Hopefully, well, Unity goes up. Cool. Uh, any other planets there? No, just just that one. Hey, that's not technology very secured. All right, uh, orbital hydroponics not a big thing. Um, let's do the science station next. Okay. And uh, how much longer before that's done? This seems to be taking a long time. Seven months, really. Okay, okay. Uh, and we need like another three months worth of mineral inputs to actually build another destroyer. I, I mean, could send these guys back, get prepared. I'm just gonna leave them there. Um, I'd like to find some sort of trader species or so I could trade for some stuff. 601, that doesn't quite do it, right? 605, so one more month. Start building that. Okay. Just a little patience. Hey, hey, hey. I've been walking the streets at night. Uh, destroyer. There we go. It's like the, the largest I've been over my naval capacity in any Stellaris game for a long time. So that's, uh, that's going to be built. And how much longer now? Four months. 
How much longer until we get this? 22 months. Why are you better at, like, beam weapons? That would be great if you were better at beam weapons. You're good at computers. Don't focus on computers so much. Focus on, like, shooty shooty bang bang stuff. Banner planet. Okay, so that's, that's getting built. Um, so I'm confident enough now to send my, like, construction ship down to some of these systems and uh, get, uh, get some good stuff going on down here. Uh, I doubt I'm going to be building any more destroyers very soon. Uh, I know that I can defend this system now, because I'm sure if these guys actually produce any more ships, they're going to be sending it after a star base here. So that's cool. And that should be done very soon. One month. Come on. Technology secured. Uh, main science station, not a big thing. Naval capacity plus 25. That is uh, huge for us right now, so we're going to take that. Seriously, this still isn't done? Okay, now it's done. All right. You guys get repaired now. Uh, 106. So construction ship. Yeah, we want you. And after you're done there, you're going to build a mining station there. Okay. Just keep you busy for a while. And, okay, we should have our new destroyer coming online very soon. How long until we get this? 16 months. And that is when the Polaron Beam 2 gets unlocked as well. Construction oh. complete. Okay. So maybe upgrading these guys with a better Polaron Beam, then we'll attack. Uh, the star base over here. Uh, I do, or I would like to upgrade this to a level 2 as well, just in case I want a secondary place building destroyer. So we'll, until we hit 200 minerals, which should be next month, off by a single mineral. Anomaly found. The anomaly there. Okay, 161. So yeah, that's going to put us at a thousand, thousand and one, or eleven hundred, not a thousand and one. That's super bad math. Uh, Thirteen months. What do we get? Another day over and deeper in debt. Be great if one of those guys would uh, level up in the next uh, year or so. Just to speed that up a little bit. That would be great. Forty-four minerals a month. Okay. Uh, so construction ship. So you're doing three, three, and another two down here. So we'll get you on that. Uh, after launching the, a shuttle to investigate Captain Kiarana and a small team from the science vessel to determine the crew of the damaged vessel with all uh, neurotoxin harmless members of the way team, leaving the aliens unconscious but alive, Captain Kiarana has successfully hacked the central computer and determined toxins picked up by the aliens after raiding a nearby star system. While lo looking... To repair the ship's engines in order to lift the vessel from the gravity well, Captain Karana was attacked by one of the crew, apparently unaffected by the neurotoxin. Fight ensues and she's injured. The alien uh, contacts the, us with a list of demands. Uh, so I could sacrifice my scientist for minerals. I do have a bit of influence right now. And I'd rather have the minerals, so uh, I am going to sacrifice her in a very cool way. Um, Shapeshifter. Not only fail risk goes down, so I'm going to take you. Uh, so, we need to get you doing things again. Yeah, we got a little mineral boost there, and we should get a mineral boost too once we take out the uh, pirate base. Okay, let's unpause here. Um, so we're still a year away from the better beams. Star system charted. So that's fine. Uh, this off. We're totally maxed out for food right now. Uh, construction ship, how you doing? Down here, you're working, working slowly. Do I want a second construction ship, I wonder? I would like to get those nine minerals. How much does a construction ship cost? 95? 
I think it's one I'm willing to spend 95 just to get our empire rolling along a little bit quicker ivory up there okay so we should get some more minerals rolling in here very soon 47 so we're almost back up to 50 uh, so yeah you guys building your sign ship and the other technologies coming out so it's gonna be nine months so we're still waiting on that like I said I'd like to get these folks uh, upgraded before we attack the uh, pirate starbase here and plus uh, at that point too we'll have construction to complete uh, spaceport has been done okay so we now have another construction ship ready to go and I would like you working in this system uh, three there might as well get that two done next to it then move down here and then down there that pretty much uses all our mineral reserves for the next while. Uh, this construction ship, you're still fairly busy. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I also would like to hit up the Sixth Society research in this system. Seven months away now, we're getting there. We are getting there. Again, a, a scientist upgrade would be spectacular just to speed things up a little bit for us. But that doesn't look like it's going to happen anytime soon. There is a little bit of physics down this system. That would speed things up a little bit. Um, physics up in the Brax system, too. Okay. Alright. Uh, well, we have over 100 minerals. I want to see if there's any more... Two energy, not a big thing for us. Brax... Uh, mainly look for minerals, so I would like a quarter there. Uh, I would look at the mining station there. Control Prime. Lots of energy, not so much for minerals. Yeah, we'll do the contemplation. We'll see how that goes for us. That's a two and one. I think I will develop you. Get a little bit of, of each uh, major resource there. Uh, build pop. So we're going to have to wait until the end of the month until we can start building you. It's nice to be able to focus on building the Empire again and not just Total War. Okay. And also, we're going to need minerals for actually upgrading our fleet very soon, so... Um, probably save over the next couple months for that to happen for us. So two construction ships working away, so we should get some nice mineral... Some nice minerals coming in. Uh, okay. So we got a bunch more unity, 26 months away from the next thing. I would like that to reduce this commerce, increase this prosperity. Okay. Uh, so population's being built on these planets. I could build another Vorta here, just to get the energy production up. But I mean, we are we're doing great for energy production right now, so we're gonna leave that alone for now. This Technology is secured. Running out of things to do. Uh, Polaron beam. Okay, so that's ready to go. Hey, it's Jordy. Uh, da -da. This is a better warp engine. Weapons damage. I like the idea of that. Getting more damage. Uh, destroy build cost minus 10%. I like the idea of having that be cheaper for us. All right, uh, let's take a look now at our ship designer. And uh, we want the better, better beam. Save that. So these guys are brawlers, so they are what, medium range? Medium range. Uh, so do I want to use these guys as like a screen for our destroyers? I'll leave things as is now. Won't get too fancy. Yeah, we'll save this design. Uh, so destroyer. Okay, so we'll get this upgraded. Save. Yes. Do we have anything that we can we can have crew bunks, which does what? Hull regeneration. I love hull regeneration. It is spectacular. Saves us cash. Can we upgrade these folks now? Yes. So we're at. I'd say we're going to be at like twelve hundred. Upgrading ships. Why hasn't that started? Because I have the game pause. Okay. Construction complete. Here. Vessels upgraded. 
eleven forty six. It's star system charge. Still not not quite where I want to be in terms of fleet strength. And why didn't our naval capacity go up? I guess we had a boost somewhere. No, it was it was these two techs that got finished. So eight months for that. Uh, so we have a construction ship not doing anything. Uh, what do I want the most? Really, I want minerals the most, but um, I will grab that plus six society. Getting that early might be good for us. Where is that? Down here. The research station there. Construction complete. Okay, clear that up. So we're doing 55 minerals a month, and it should be 61 after everything has been exploited in this system. We'll have a few more minerals coming in once this Vorta is online. Uh, there's another mineral there, so I will build a, uh, a Vorta there. It's interesting having to manually build your population, so you have to, you have to think things a little bit differently. Plus, you're, you're physically using minerals to, to do it. Uh, yeah. So, I have spent money. Or, in this case, I have spent minerals. But I would like to spend minerals on ships. Or at least one more destroyer before I take on that, uh, that pirate base. Good thing about taking on that pirate base, too, uh, we should get... A bit of a boost to minerals, I think. Construction Maybe complete. Some energy, which is would be literally wasted. Construction complete. Unidentified empire coming up. Okay. Situation log updated. A beta menace. Are they space whales or anything? They're surveying the system. Okay. Interesting. So there, I mean, there should be a, a couple of empires at around us. So that should be completely unexpected. Uh, I just hope that, uh, you know, we're kind of staying ahead of the game in terms of fleet power. Uh, so two more months for the naval capacity. Story build costs is going to be great for us. 10% so be 60 less uh, minerals a month, which is basically a full month less that it would take to build one of those. Four, 61... This construction ship's not doing anything. Yeah, I am, I am saving secured. up for another another full-up destroyer. I think that's the best way for us to go. Uh, yeah, let's go for habitability. Uh, so 60 a month now. We're going to have another four in the next few months. Uh, 25 months for that. 33, that's... that's gonna Star take system long, charted. Long. Uh, science ship. Okay, you need some stuff to do here, my friend. So we'll get you to check out this side of the galaxy. 4.30 now. So just want to wanna get enough to get that final destroyer before I attack their, uh, attack their space station there. Now I do have an Admiral too who won't retreat. Um... Uh, so I definitely don't want to go into the firefight and lose. <laughs> I want to win it. Um, so yeah, we, we're, we definitely want to overpower them. Good thing though, they get uh, plus 10 ship hull points. So they have a little bit more about building. Apparently we have two destroyer destroyer class classes. Get rid of one of those uh, ship designer. Uh, this one. So this, I'm guessing you have the lesser. Oh, okay. So one has the crew quarters, the other does. Okay. So six fifteen. So one more month, we can start that build. Uh, so we'll do that. Six forty, rather. Okay, never mind. One more month then. <laughs> Just get keep pushed back. Uh, so another two minerals coming in very soon. That'll be 71 a month. It's the Truman system. It's the Jim Carrey system. Uh, eight, uh, seven. Okay, there we go. So we'll build one more. So uh, that's that's gonna take a while. So I'm gonna build that, and uh, I'll run my attack 
on construction Beach House. complete. And uh, that will be the the episode. It's going to be a little bit of a longer episode. Uh, my first episodes usually tend to be a little bit longer. So um, if you're wondering when this is going to end, uh, that's that that's the end point that I'm looking for right now. Uh, five months that doesn't really help with much. It's just power generation. It's a potentially habitable planet in this system. 200 now. Uh, in this case, he needs he needs some stuff to do. So we'll get you to hit up those uh, two energy, and you need something to do. So we'll get you to hit up the three energy there. I really should be focusing on the minerals, but uh, you know, kind of having that energy base is fine too. And then you, I'm going to get you to come up here then, and uh, I'm actually not going to get you to build there because that is a habitable planet. I'll get you to come over here though for the two minerals. Construction complete. Okay. And it's going to be a while before that's actually finished. I should tell us 68%. Be great if this system has a whole bunch of minerals too. That would be fantabulous. Another nine mineral system. I'd love that. I'd love it a lot. So we can't do anything with Truman. Ivory we can. So we're we'll send this ship up here to hit up Ivory afterwards. Go tickle the Ivories, so to speak. Technology secure. Uh, Power plant three. Power not a big thing, but let's take it anyway. Anomaly found. Research there. Might be some nice stuff. Hopefully we don't kill off. Construction the complete. Uh, all right. So you got to move up to there. So that's going to be 12, 1300 for fleet, fleet strength. That should hopefully do it for us. Uh, we'll do the contemplations. And see what happens there. Again, it, it seems like a straight up gamble to do that. But uh, otherwise, we're not producing unity at that uh, at rate of a rate. Uh, how much is it for the patrol ship? 300. Might build a few more of those. Uh, patrol ships seem to have like value in in um, New Horizons because I mean, if you build enough of them, you can certainly do a swarm tactic, Zerg rush, so to speak. Uh, Toad asteroid has some engineering there that we can hit up. So you guys are busy, right? Okay. 270. So I want you to join up. And I will start building replacement ships. Okay, so we got a bit of a unity boost there. Uh, so what does this do? Prosperity. Uh, reduces comments and housing construction costs. Okay. I think we're building that much in terms of housing anyway, but that's fine. That is fine. Still way over our naval capacity right now. All right, so 1.3k. I'm hoping should do it for us. Uh, if it doesn't, I'm gonna be very sad. Again, we can't retreat because of the uh, attacking enemy assets. The way this guy's set up, but we should have uh, a bit better host. Wow. Bullshit you're getting eaten up pretty quickly here. Of course, the game's saving right in the middle of combat. Which is Construction complete. We're actually shooting at it. We're starting to chip away. There we go. Get a little bit close, guys. I haven't set the medium range, but I should have went straight up rolling. Might take a while for this to actually finish up, so uh, I'm gonna actually speed this up. Plus, with 80% less than that, our evasion sucks, that's for sure. 30, is that enough to build a window on the east? No. Maybe I've got a month. A reasonable replacement should be going up. Another one of those. Like seriously, it shouldn't take us months to blow one of these things up, but uh, 
that seems to be how this is rolling right now. This is where it's not going to itself. Thankfully, we have uh, the food cards, which should be a little bit of repairing. Construction complete. Uh, what do we build here? Mining station. Construction complete. Construction complete. So it's uh we've taken off about 30% of its health. Uh, again, I, I can't retreat, so it's gonna be whatever it is. Getting there, I guess. But it's a, it's a slow grind, but we lost something. Not a very slow thing. Game saving place, we're going to try to look at something. 40% taken off. They have good armor. That's a uh, 250. It's a bit of a grind here, but I'll, I'll keep pumping out patrol ships. That. How's that destroyed? Then? Okay, not great, but okay. So it's less than 50% health right now. Yeah, I'm trying to add. It doesn't look like uh, we seem to be. Losing a patrol ship at the rate that we're replacing them, because I'm pretty sure this has been four and eight for the, uh, for the majority here. Technology secure. What is this? Habitability? Not a big thing. Uh, we will take the Interstellar Academy. Construction complete. Another ship coming up there. Thirty-five percent for health. Again, this is, this is literally taking us charged. months to blow up the space station. Imagine that in real life, like, living on that space station. It's like, hey, what's going on? Eh, well, the uh, Gen Jar are attacking us again. Uh, oh, yeah. Well, how's that different from yesterday? It's, it's not. It's actually completely the same. Uh, are we getting there? 25% health? that's done so i'm gonna end things off there for now hey if you enjoyed what you saw think about liking the video think about subscribing see you next time take care have yourself a great day